With just the end of general elections in Zambia, many people have high expectations from the newly elected president, Hakain the huge lemma of the United Party for National Development, UPND. It is for this reason various stakeholders have continued calling upon the seventh president-elect Hakain de Hichlima to come to their aid and address their challenges. Among them are the small-scale traders. Speaking to Movie TV News in Lusaka, some small-scale traders have called upon the newly elected president to consider youth empowerment as a way of fighting poverty in the country. <laughs> Bachinjeko na economy. At least, maybe economy kachinjako, ibirereko pansi, tizankara ko bwino. And then, bafakileko, bachiteko na vintu, vakuti, vika, vinga tichiteko mwushi, is ma business money. Vintu vonzi viendele pasogoro. Te, ma business money. At least, batipasa ko something, ya kuti business ya tu ya indako pati, pa mwamba. We are expecting, actually, from this new regime, our expectations are very high. You know, the people voted in numbers expecting some change. The previous government gave a lot of money to some musicians, stuff like that. Leaving out us, the small-scale entrepreneurs, we also need some capital, we need some money, but the government has deliberately ignored us. So this new regime, we need change. That's why we voted. Zero four, I was on the queue voting for change. So we need the, the real change. They have, uh, the, uh, they have gone to government. It has worked. We have seen a lot of But we had the challenges of cutters, industries, markets, intercities, so on. The resources go to the government. And the current government has come over. We have already started seeing what they are doing in terms of uh, just handing over the uh, intercity from the cadres to the uh, city, Lusaka city councils, marketers and other things. We have even seen the dollar depreciating. COVID-19 has brought about change in the way business is conducted worldwide. Zambia in particular is one of the countries that has experienced a sharp shift in the way business is conducted across all its business sectors and the most affected are the small-scale traders. Hence, this needs to include them in youth empowerment and developmental issues without leaving anyone behind. Margaret Shota, Movie TV News in Lusaka.